Hey guys, today I will be unboxing the Art Squad doll, Lady T. She's the last Art Squad doll that I have to open. Huge thank you to Just Play Toys and the Art Squad for having me at the Camp Art Squad event in New York City. It was amazing. I'm really, really enjoying these dolls. And it is time to open our last Lady T. <laughs> So here is a Lady T all out of the box, and I'm actually, ah, I can't decide who's my favorite anymore. Um, oh my gosh, I am loving her color palette and everything that she comes with. Oh, I'm hating that I'm liking every doll more than the last doll. Ugh. She comes with three paintbrush markers. We've got purple, hot pink, and a light pink. You could use the markers to color in her accessories, her pants, and of course her photoed frame. The frame is hot pink and it says Lady T, and there's a picture of her that you can color in. She comes with a purple hairbrush. It has a heart and a crown on it. Now the back of the box lets us know that Lady T does stencil art. And sorry and not sorry, her birthday is February 5th. Her favorite color is purple. Her personality is fun, edgy, and spunky. Her favorite thing to do is volunteer at schools. Her art style is mural paintings. Fashion style is a street savvy mix of colors and patterns, and her favorite art tool is stencils. Here's a QR code so you can join the art squad, and here's our other dolls. And here's a gorgeous drawing of Lady T. Because she is a stenciling artist, she comes with these stencils and a little stamping press so that you can use this kit that she comes with as a stamping set. We've got purple, a darker purple, and a hot pink. You can stamp those onto her jacket. She also comes with this light pink scrunchie that you can stamp all over. One thing I love about these dolls is that they come with sticker eyeshadows that you can stick onto the doll to change her eyeshadow. All of hers are kind of purpley pink. Each doll also comes with a backdrop so you can take awesome pictures. Every single doll also comes with a doll stand and the bottoms are paint palettes. Here is a Lady T. She comes with a light purpley pink headband that says Lady T that you could color in yourself. And she has matching heart earrings. I am gonna be taking these out so that I could take the rubber band out. Now Lady T has a darker blonde hair with lavender highlights in it. There's the no gel, it's very soft. And the rooting is also not bad. Now, Lady T has some darker brown eyebrows, some light pink eyeshadow, some pink lips, blush going across her face, and she has pretty purple eyes. She has a white and black shirt that has a little emoji on the front that you can color. Over it is her pink jacket. We've got some, some holographic glitters as details and a hot pink glittery detailing as well. She does have on a black chain plastic belt. Her pants are actually overalls, so we've got some black overall strings, but then the pants themselves are blue and white and you can color them. These dolls also come with lots of articulation. We've got the head, the shoulders, the elbows, the hands, the hips, the knees, and the doll's legs also rotate at the hips. Well, the Art Squad dolls have some of the best shoes that I have seen in a very, very long time. This is definitely my favorite part of Lady T. We've got light pink boot heels that have hot pink chains and drips and then black heels and laces. And you know exactly who I'm gonna say these shoes would look amazing on. That is Lady T all out of her box. I am really, really liking her. Go check out my other videos, unboxing Nini, Vanna, Andy, and next video I will be ranking all of the Art Squad dolls, so come back for that. But I am in love with her. Ah!